Hello guys, how are you? This is lecture number 3 of Tally ERP9 which is accounting software and in this lecture we will pro we will create payment at receipt vouchers. For this purpose we will have to go to accounting voucher and short key for this voucher is V. I press V. This is this window is payment voucher. Here we will write some ledger and this ledger can be bank account ledger or cash ledger. We have not we have not created a cash ledger but but Tally provides us cash ledger along with profit and loss ledger built in this software. We will use cash ledger. I press C. This is cash ledger. I press enter to select this ledger here. I will select our main ledgers which we have created in lecture number 2 and those are ABC's capital ledger and ABC's expense ledger. So we will uh, pay our employee, I, our employee we can pay to any party dealing with our company from both of the ledgers but this one is capital ledger I press enter here amount of 10 million is shown and this amount is credit but payment is debit of account so when I want to pay some amount like one million I press enter and amount this is tapered amount and here capital balance reduced to nine million and this amount 1 million shifted to cash amount but this amount is in red letters and this shows unauthorized payment because we have no we have no reason to pay this amount but this is this payment is meant to tell you to teach you how to pay, how to create a payment voucher. So I press enter as I did not want to pay anything more and here I will write some duration for the purpose of this payment. I write here payment made to Mr. A. Mr. A, Mr. B, Mr. C, I think this is capital, select payment made, to Mr. A. This notation is optional, you press enter and select yes and your payment voucher is created. Now I want to create a receipt voucher and from here we can look out its short key that is F6. I press F6 and voucher is changed, payment voucher is changed to receipt voucher. Here again I will select my account and 
that is cash count i press enter this amount is shown which we have entered in payment voucher and this is unauthorized amount now when i receive some money from someone some party like mr b and we will watch it this ledger cash ledger's behavior payment and receipt will have should have different behavior opposite behavior i think i can say i should say but it will increases as this shows this is accumulation of money or flow of cash i write here a b c a press and then you will see expense and capital ledgers you choose your ledger if we receive money in capital you can choose expense also i press enter here i want to write 5 lakh half a million i press enter and this amount in capital ledger increases as it was 90 lakh or 9 million now half million added up into this amount but here instead of decreasing this amount it is increasing and this shows either we pay or we receive money this amount increases and this amount which is in red increases and this shows flow of cash i press enter i give duration payment received from mr b i press enter press yes so viewers you have created two ledgers payment ledger and receipt sorry two vouchers and those are payment voucher and receipt voucher in this way in the next lecture we will cover our contra voucher for the purpose we will have to create a bank ledger so stay tuned i say you goodbye i hope you have enjoyed this lecture thank you very much